I tell you folks, just got off at the train station just there. Seattle. No, Washington. That's a whole row of tents. Ten cities like that. I've never been on eight in two different states. Even during the daytime. This ten city problem here is a huge, massive issue for anyone living on this side of the constantly constantly on the uh, on the edge looking out for anyone jumping at you screaming and slamming a bottle on your head it's uh, I've traveled enough places on this earth to keep my wits about but I've never been so much on your edge <coughs> So much on the edge where folks are just falling onto the streets of this entire West Coast states just to avoid coming out of the dark, absolute pitch dark around just outside the train station there. And, uh, I had to keep my head down and keep jogging, pretending that I uh, that I'm uh, a local jogging with a jogging with my wits about where I know I'm going. <laughs> That's what you have to do. And you are in a homeless, oh, how do you say, unhoused community. Everybody's living in tents. It's uh, scary, worrying, even more. Absolutely sad because. This shouldn't happen to a country like this in the great America. This should not even happen to <clears throat> a third world nation. Never mind talking about this great nation of America in fear. Oh in horror of shock or shock of horror and start running at least to make myself <laughs> be confident of the street that I'm walking upon because here we are not far to get to sort of safety safety of my Hotel room, hotel room. And uh, yeah, not a nice for you. You can hear the sounds of excessive use of chemicals, the unb unbalanced. This is how they've all been. Constantly 